question three and a number of other questions relate to uh, the Arab Spring. Uh, question three is, I would like to know why it's necessary to have both the Mediterranean Dialogue and the Istanbul Cooperation Initiative. These are two separate frameworks that NATO has. They seem to be similar, writes uh, Isabel Summerson from the Univers University of Maastricht uh, and University of New South Wales, so she travels a lot. Um, why would we not combine them? And the, the answer to that is uh, that they are different. They look the same. Uh, they're from two adjacent regions, one North Africa, second the Gulf. But um, they are different. They have different memberships. They also have different ways of working. Uh, the Mediterranean Dialogue uh, also has a multilateral framework. It brings everybody together, the six Arab countries and Israel. And I think everybody understands that it's very important and valuable to have a framework where Israel can sit down with its uh, Arab uh, confrères uh, in the region uh, and they can discuss common security challenges. There aren't that many places where that happens. The Mediterranean Dialogue is one place where that does happen. The Gulf uh, relationship through the ICI is much more bilateral, NATO to each one of the four countries. We hope that that relationship will grow and that we can bring in, by the way, new countries, uh, Saudi Arabia and Oman, uh, the other two members of the Gulf Cooperation Council. It might happen. Uh, we hope it will. There's an invitation to them. We think it would make the ICI stronger. We think it would make our contribution to regional security better. But that will happen, uh, I hope, uh, soon.